Chris Fernandez here in Salt Lake City, Utah, here to talk about heavy bag techniques. The materials you'll need are a set of uh, gloves, boxing heavy bag gloves, and also heavy bag. And so here's a couple tips on to help you out as far as getting started. First of all, you want to make sure your feet are shoulder width apart. Get enough distance from the bag where you can actually, you hit it from a distance where you get your power at the very end of your punch. And so hands together here in a boxing stance. There's a couple different jabs you can do. Jab to the body, jab to the head. So you're jabbing down, jabbing up, okay? Jab down, jab up. Now we got a right hand, right to the body, back to the head. Right to the body, back to the head. Got a hook, so I throw the right hand, I turn my body, position for a left hook, body, head. Right hand, body, head, and back to the starting position. Again, this is Chris Fernandez here at Flash Academy in Salt Lake City, Utah, and I just demonstrated some tips on the heavy back technique. Hi, my name is Jonathan, and I'm with Champion MMA. Today we're going to hit a show how to hit the speed back. Uh, speed back is used for creating good standing when you're boxing, get some little speed on your hands. Uh, it's, it'll create good fundamental on your punches. The first thing you want to do it is stay uh, in front of the back. In this case, we have a back that is adjusted. We can bring it. We got to bring it to the level that we needed to bring it in order, you know, to hit it right. Another thing you want to do it is make sure when you start hitting it, you get into. It's got to be a balance that you have to have a ribbon that you when you hit the back. You know, you, if you don't catch that rhythm, you're going to have, you know, but it takes practices on the speed bat to really get that going. Uh, first thing you want to do is stamp on your stamp, fighter stamp, and then bring your hands up and start punching it, okay? And then you go from one arm to the other arm, and then you start catching up the rhythm little step by step how to hit the, uh, the speed bat, okay? That's the way, uh, basic state, to hit its speed back, okay? Alright guys, now we're going to do some bag drills um, to practice your kickboxing. First off, we're going to start with just repetitive punching, kicking, knee strikes, elbow strikes, round kicks. So, First, I want to practice my hands by punching non-stop. Boom. Making sure I'm constantly twisting my hand over. Twisting, twist, 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 bringing it right back to my chin every single time. Right from there, practice my uppercuts. Turn, turn, turning my fist at the last second. Turn, turn, turn. Hooks, same deal, but you want to keep them short. Point A to point B, hook, 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 hook. Now, elbows. Elbow comes up, hand stays in front of your face. Elbow, 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 elbow. You can roughly aim for going around 30 seconds for each one, a minute, depending on how, how daring or you know, how good you feel. But you definitely want to try at least be one to three minutes would be you try to do all these moves within that time frame. Okay? Now, right from the elbows, 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 you go with the rear knee kick, rear knee, rear knee, rear knee. You can switch, knee, knee, knee. Now it's gonna get a little harder by doing a knee, switch, knee, switch, knee, switch, knee, switch, knee. Now you can move back. Start with our front, front kicks. Push, what you're trying to do now is catch the bag. Push, push, catch the bag before it comes in. Keep them away, keep them away, keep them away. Then switch legs, push, and catch, catch, catch. Catch, roundhouse kicks, you're gonna step, you're gonna keep your weight here the whole time, All right? and kick, 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 and switch, take your step, keep your weight there the whole time, and kick, 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 kick. That's just a good way to practice pretty much all your attacks, um, and obviously train your cardio at the same time. Now, we're gonna just practice some other drills where you could do now, it's a little bit more technical. You could do one, two, kick, 
and then switch. One, two, switch, kick. One, two, kick. One, two, kick. One, two, kick. Over and over, obviously, uh, you're gonna get tiring after a while. You can do a uh, knee, elbow, switch knee, elbow, knee, elbow, pretty much doing the same side over and over. From back here, front kick, front kick, front kick, front kick, front kick, front kick, opposed to doing the same leg. And those are just some basic back drills you can do for kickboxing. My name is Tanya Batts and I'm a personal trainer at Gold's Gym. I want to talk to you today about how to work out on a punching bag. Now Muhammad Ali's coach never let him touch a bag until he was warmed up. He made him do a lot of shadow boxing because you do not want to hit a bag with a cold muscle. Here's just a few, a quick review on the bag if you're just brand new, just starting out. You want to put a leg towards the bag. You never want to face it because someone can hit you, you're falling over. One foot close to the bag, one foot back. You want to jab. Hitting him with the first two knuckles. That's the jab. The cross comes from the back of the body. Cross. That's your power. This is to stun him. This is to hurt him. Now you've got hooks, jaw, hook. You gotta lift the heel. Because if you don't lift the heel, you could really pull your back. So that's one, two, three. Jab, cross, hook. You got the uppercut. Usually an uppercut, you wanna go underneath the chin, but he doesn't have a chin. So I'm going for the gut. You really wanna think about going right. I'm going down, but I'm driving up because I'm trying to get underneath the ribs. So you got jab, cross, hook, up. So you want, you don't wanna sacrifice form for speed. You just wanna make sure you've got a beautiful. Then when you get comfortable, Awesome. Okay, here comes the kicks. Kick. Boom. Pushing through the heel or the ball of the foot. Right in the stomach. Side kick. Someone's coming at you from the side. Right into the stomach or the face. Pushing through the heel. Roundhouse is next. So, I'm just pointing my toe. Front of the body, not a lot of power. The back of the body comes around, watch what happens. Death, if you want it. So you got jab, cross, hook, up, front kick, roundhouse. Push him off of it. Great way to get a good cardio. And that's how you work out on the punching bag. For more details, click the link in the description. Thanks for watching the video. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel.